now that you have heard me pour out my entire life story, um, I'm now going to show you my garden. And as you can see, I have been trying to grow daisies. And daisies are, I think, some of my most favourite flowers. And I'll show you why. I bought these daisies um, about six months ago in between lockdown maybe lockdown two and three when i was able to travel a bit further out to a town called trentham and um i bought them from a lovely lady on the side of a road uh she looks like no one has visited her for a while and um, i came in looking for white flowers and i knew that i had to get some daisies when i saw these these are called i think the margaritas that sounds like a drink doesn't it <laughs> anyway aren't they just exquisite such innocent beautiful lovely flowers and also equally favorite um, our ivy I've always loved ivy and um, I was walking with my friend the other day along one of the nicest streets along here and um, I, there was a branch that was hanging out from someone's garden and I just took like a snippet of it just like you know it broke off something about this big and came home and propagated it which is great and here um, is a I don't know what it's called but I love the pinkness of it it's just so sweet so yeah so that's basically um, some of the plants that I have been trying to grow uh, well flowers really and then alongside of that are these beautiful lavenders which I also put in roughly the same time. Um, lavenders and daisies apparently are quite hardy plants, so not even I can possibly kill them, hopefully. So, but so far, so good. So, together, these three things three plants, the lavender, the daisies, and the ivy have been my favorite sort of pastime, and I've been looking after them fairly well, I think. So now that I've shown you my daisies and my lavender and my ivy, I'm going to show you um, a flower that's taking a bit of a departure from the white and green and the more muted tones of lavender. So, so here they are. These are called clivias. It's kind of a strange name, but they're just so beautiful. Um, explosions of orange bursts of little happiness. And they bring me so much joy. Um, I don't know, people say, oh, I don't want any orange in my garden, but why wouldn't you want orange in the garden? I think this is the happiest spot in the garden, um, just for the fact that it's this such, this beautiful, you know, color alone. And they're really hardy plants. Like, I think I must have moved these five clivias five times since I have moved into this place this house and um, they have survived and are really adaptable and a little bit like me I think in some ways but saying that the daisies really are my favorite flowers I want to show you now just how beautiful this sky is today I mean if you're gonna be locked down what you need really is a sky that can be blue sometimes and greenery with some flowers and some sunshine what else do you want <laughs> well then i think this first video is probably long enough and so i don't want to bore you any further but i wanted to end by showing you this beautiful rosemary bush that i have behind me actually normally it's a lot bigger um, as you can see it's a bit small that's the root down there but my dear mother um, whom I haven't seen for a while because of COVID uh, decided to give it a bit of a pruning and she gave it too much of a haircut so it's literally bald right now but it still gives us some beautiful shrubs um, some beautiful herbs for when we make like Italian di dishes um, and Greek ones too. Anyway, that's my rosemary bush. And then of course, to end it off, I'd like to show you another variety of daisies. I don't know what these ones are called, but they're also beautiful. So look at them. I'm 
Aren't they gorgeous? Just so nice. Beautiful. And behind there is going to be some flowers and so some jasmine all along there. <laughs> oh my goodness, my camera work leaves a lot to be desired. Anyway, um, I think I'll end it here. Thank you so much for joining me. I still can't work out where I should be looking, but uh, I think it's that green dot there. Uh, I really appreciate all your time um, joining me today and I'm sorry if I've rambled on but I'm hoping to come back with a better episode every um, Friday okay so I'll see you next Friday I think I'll post every Friday um, today's Thursday but I think Friday it will be okay until then bye bye baby I've been thinking my silence has a sinking But the magic is gone Cause I'm left all alone So it's time to go home Moments stolen moments from harm Got me lost under your charms Glowing heat wave and